Yesterday, I finished sealing up the uh, left fuel tank. Um, right now, the tank sealant is curing, and I have to wait a week or two before I finish work on that. And without any delay, I'm moving straight along into building the fuselage of the airplane. Now, the fuselage is the center structure of the airplane right here. I've already built the tail cone, the horizontal and vertical stabilizer, elevator and rudder, and all this. So most of this stuff from the back, from the fuselage back, is completed. I've also largely done most of the wings. I've done the flaps, the ailerons, most of the wing structure. There's a couple things I need to do, like I need to do some wiring, put in the pedostatic tube, and things like that. But the wings are, to a large extent, done. But the fuselage, I haven't even begun to work on the fuselage. And this is where you sit, your passions are sit, and where you put your baggage. So in some sense, this is like the main structure of the airplane. Specifically, I'm going to be working on the mid-fuse bulkheads. So these are the structures that primarily uh, transfer the loads from the wings uh, into the fuselage and kind of the main load-bearing structures of the airplane, specifically this one right here. So I basically just need to take these bulkheads and add a whole bunch of things to it, like uh, things for the seats um, and other stuff. So that's what I'm going to be working on. Now, I'm really, really excited to start working on the fuselage for a couple reasons, but probably the chief among them is that working on the fuselage is not going to be working on the wings. The wings just feel so repetitive, and I've been working on those suckers for I don't even want to know how long. By contrast, the fuselage has lots of unique parts and stuff like that, and that's going to be fun to build. Uh, the second reason why I'm excited to be working on the fuselage is just so I can impress people when they come over. Um, when people find out I'm building an airplane, they want to come see it, and then they come over and see parts scattered all over the house and like the wings off in the corner. It doesn't look that impressive. But the fuselage, that's where you sit. And so uh, once that structure starts getting built, it'll actually look like I'm uh, building an airplane in my garage for real, and that will impress all the kids in the neighborhood, which is one of the main reasons why I'm doing this project in the first place. So last summer, I actually processed most of the parts for this first step. So everything's all ready to go. Everything's primed, uh, deburred, and all that kind of thing. So this first part right here is going to be some of the funnest stuff you can do in building an airplane, which is actually riveting things together and see everything uh, uh, come together in a permanent type structure. Um, so deburring parts, priming, that's just tedious. But when you actually get to build things and rivet it together, that's exciting. So anyway, without further delay, I'm going to start working.
right, so that's pretty much it. Uh, I just finished riveting together all the bulkheads that are going through the mid fuselage. Um, it consists of this guy right here, which is kind of going to be in the back. Um, this thing right here, which has a skirt on it, I think, that's going to hold part of the, a lot of the stress from the wings. Um, this thing was kind of fun to make. And then I have these two big suckers right here. Uh, this one that's more towards the front. And this one that kind of is towards the back a little bit. Uh, and these things are going to basically uh, take the uh, loads from the main wing spars. So these are going to be some of the main weight bearing structures of the aircraft. Anyway, putting these together were <laughs> pretty fun. Uh, also pretty straightforward. None of the riveting was particularly challenging. Everything went together without a hitch. Uh, so that's it for this time. Uh, next video I'm going to be making, I'm going to be starting work on the mid fuselage. Uh, and that's pretty involved, but I'm looking forward to it. So that's it for now.